Hello guys, it is Sean Spin. Didn't see my leg. Beautiful. And um so I'm just making a sort of vlog except for I thought this could go on the main channel, so I won't put it on Sean Spin. But what it is is it is just showing you the mock that I'm working on. So, um or mock slash base is what this is. I'm like Tatooine, Tatooine, I'm not sure, you know, Sandy Planet. So basically what we're going to do is we're just going to cover this whole thing in um, tan pieces. I have some right there. But um, it's almost done. Here is, okay, it's fine. I guess I'm just going to kind of be showing you guys this. So, so far we have covered this much. And um, this is where the other part of the base is going to be. It's complicated. You can't even imagine what it's going to look like. I'll show you guys actually what it will look like. Here it is. So, I actually just did it at the school. Because everyone I showed the weird sketch to didn't um get get it. So, I do this better one. So, here's the first race that's what I'm working on. So I have like that much. Because I won't, this is going to have two floors. And then... Here's that doorway, and then there's like a skyway up here. I'm saying it in a lot. There's a skyway up here that leads into this part, which is like I think the barracks might be down here, or maybe up here, and then more stuff. And then I guess it's kind of a control tower, and um, yeah. And so work on that, and um, but. So, I guess I'll start showing you guys it. So, first of all, me and George just made a trip to the Lego store. Got some pieces, you know, four big cups, which isn't actually that much. It, um, so, gauges. We got some of these weird gauge things, like in cars or whatever. We got some control panels. We're, like, set for life for those. Um, let me see. What else did we get? We got some, we got a lot of tan pieces. I got some two-by-twos, which sadly I only had time to get one cup of. So, yeah. Um... Here's a roof sample. Except for this section, um, but that's just a sample. And then we got some lime green pieces. Tan, I already said that. George has the other ones. He's working on a chic, no, indoor mock back at his house. And, um, so we made like an Ewok hutish thing a little so far. We don't have that much of it, but we have like the roof, which isn't actually done. And so now I'll just show you guys what kind of is in the base. So, I guess this is like the armory right here. So, I have this massive gun rack. It's not that massive, but it is indeed a gun rack and a rifle just fell out. So, it's like this. They can like, they can like move it around. So, they got handles. And, um, that little pushy thing. And counting the rifle that just fell out... This is holding 50 guns right now. So, yes. And then I have this missile rack. It's not that cool, but I just made it to hold, like, flick fire. So it holds four. Just pull those out if you want to. And um, then in here, we have this briefing table, which I covered the top of just for coolness. Of, um, with one by, like, clear one by twos. I guess it's like a hologram or glass or something. I don't know. No. If it was glass, I would have done tiles. So, And there's just four chairs around it. <clears throat> and then here is some like food crates with like vegetables in it or something. I don't know. Here's like a water tank with two panels with gauges on top and a swiveling chair. Right here. It swivels because it's a swiveling chair. And then, um, this is tube coming out of the water tank that is going to go up into the top one and connect, I think, to this thing. I don't know. I could just run all the way through. And I have this shelf here, kind of random, with canisters that are yellow. That's how cool it is. And then here is where they just, like, sweeped away the sand. Sorry about this crack thing going right down here. That is just because this is one of those weird giant platforms that's like two, one, except for, actually you guys, these big platforms, these ones, 
if you look at it, this is one big rectangle platform. Okay, so that's just one big rectangle platform. And actually, each of the base plates on here is this might be a long block. Is um a row all around bigger than a regular gray base plate. It's weird. And um I guess that's about it actually. This is all I was really gonna show you guys. So um oh, I used to collect manacles, I have more than that though. Um random small piles of Legos. You guys, I just love this. It looks cool. Oh yeah, and then I have these three stairs. I forgot to show you I got to tell you about this, guys. I'm actually gonna use the third one, so fuck off. But these two I'm going to have, you know, go go like you know how like good staircases do, so I'm just gonna set that down. Arr! See I'm looking at the camera lens right now. Not the lens but the thing right now. You know, ugh. Like um this, you know. Going up into the roof onto the roof and also the second floor. Same time. So yeah, this is going to be kind of a random vlog, you guys, because I never make them. This is one of these, which actually I'm going to use for trees, or we are. Hey, George. I, I gotta, ah, I gotta bring this to George from to use. Ah, we're still kind of sorting this all out, so I still have to bring, like, all my grass and stuff over to his place, this thing, and all these lime green pieces. Um... I just brought some tan pieces back. Those and some of these plates. So basically all the other all I have to cover now with tan back around here. I have to make that base with all those random gates. So this has been a rather random vlog, you guys. So um thumbs up for Lego Star Wars and bye.